What's up YouTube, it's Dinosaur here, and today I have a video for you about FlixPress. If you were on my channel, you could have seen, um, I had three intros up that, uh, I let people comment on and tell me what they, what they think of them, and, um, they were all made by this website. FlixPress is basically a way for you to create free intros that look really professional, and they're completely free. And, uh, just one more thing before you, uh, go, oh, this guy's a fake, this guy's a fake, they do cost money. Yeah, they cost money, and that's only for the pro intros, and the pro intros are amazing. Um, they're nothing compared to, uh, uh, the free ones, but the free ones are still really good. If you saw the ones on my channel, those are all free, and, uh, people commented and said they were pretty good. So, um, for a free intro, all four of these, they're free. For free intros, I'd say they're probably top of the top. And I'm not saying that just to brag, I'm saying that because they're easy to make, they're completely free, and they look really good when they come out. And it doesn't really matter what you put on them, the uh, animations and everything just look really good. So um, I'd say this is probably one of the best program, I mean, websites out there for this type of uh, intro creating. So um, basically, I've been uh, creating three intros. I made three intros for myself, and then one intro for a YouTube viewer. I believe his name is Joy Manchus. Sorry if I don't get the pronunciation right. Anyway, um, this is what I made for him. Uh, I'd say it looks pretty good. He likes it. So I made that for him and uh, he liked it and um, that took almost no effort to make and I really could not put in more effort for that. All you have to do is just put it, upload an image, uh, put custom text and you're good. And um, if you want you can uh, uh, spend some more money on this website. You can uh, get pro intros. Why you ask? I don't know. Maybe because um, they're a lot better looking, but uh, either way, you can buy them and you will get pretty good intros. I didn't buy them because I don't really need something that awesome. Um, for example, this is what I'm thinking about using. I created this for myself. Yeah, so I created that for myself. And um, I think it looks pretty good. And then I created two others, which you can see on my channel. But that's not what we're, what we're here about. We're here about um, I'm making this video so you know what to do. So uh, let's go. Um, first, you have to register. That's the most important thing. See, I'm registered with my account. And uh, you can go to automated templates on the top. And uh, um, the one I'm just going to show you, for example, you can select anything that says free over here. And uh, things that cost money, for example, like one dollar, they're gonna ask you to first enter like credit card information and stuff like that, so you so you can buy it. Um, but basically, um, in the all section where it shows you all the intros, go to the second page and uh, it's right on top. It's called Robot X Form. So you click on that. It's gonna go through an intro, just like a just. It's just gonna show you the template right now. So that's just a template. So I'll go over here, click customize. I agree. Customize now. And basically, enter any text you want. Just for uh, purposes of this video, I'm going to type in Dinosaur. And um, I prefer Audio Track 1 just for this intro. Audio Track 1 is my favorite. If you don't click Audio Track, it's going to um, automatically go to sound effects only and sound effects only means it's going to require you to upload your own audio when you are done um, getting the intro so it's going to be completely silent there's going to be no sound so if I click on it right now it's not going to do any preview it's just going to do uh, the same thing as audio track one because that's what I selected for it. so um, you can uh, just type in the text, select 
um, an audio track, there's sound effects only. And then down here, um, there are some options that you have to look at. Um, these all cost money, but you might want to consider using them. Um, these uh, intros are not automatically in 720p. They're in, uh, I believe, 360 or 420. I don't. They're not in HD. They're they're not super low quality, but they're not the best. And um, you can add a one month hosting extension, meaning uh, if you create the intro today, it will you'll still be able to download it for another month. Usually, if you don't uh, buy that, it's gonna go away in a week, and you have to download it immediately. And uh, also, you can also buy. Um, the pro intros, like I said before, and for those, it can get a little annoying when you have to buy the intro, then you have to buy the the 720p. But um, it's it might get a little annoying, but it's all just for uh, the intro to look better and to uh, so you have the best intro possible in uh, such easy steps to follow. So basically, once you're done selecting your options putting in your custom text, click next and uh, it's going to tell you right here so it's going to tell you some information about it, it says intro text dinosaur audio choice one SD file only which is zero dollars it's one week hosting which is zero dollars and the total price will come up to zero dollars so now you have to upload an image and I'm just going to upload the stock dinosaur android that I always use so uh, it's right here and that's the Android version of me. So it's here, and then I click upload. And you're gonna have to crop it because this will only work. You will only be able to uh, exactly put um, the whole picture in if it's 400 by 400 and uh, no larger than 600. So um, the what the preferred dimensions are for this picture, they say that. 600 by 400 is the best uh, are the best dimensions for this um, you'll get the best looking picture if it's already in high quality it won't blur it or anything like that so you'll get the best looking picture if it's 600 uh, approximately 600 by 400 but you don't have to do that and um, I'm okay with cropping it because there's no point of even showing like anything below and I don't really want to show the website so I'm just showing like part of the pants and the torso of this guy is the most important part and uh, that's all I need to show so basically I can click next once I'm done with the image and then it's going to give you a, sl a small snapshot like a thumbnail of what it's going to look like and then you can submit order so submit order and here's what it's going to tell you so it's going to tell you your order number and your order ID and um, it's going to send you an email and in one to two minutes it's going to appear in your account intros so I'm just gonna exit out of this and uh, scroll up to um, my account and over here in my account here it is I just created it so uh, it will allow me to uh, uh, download this and I'm just going to show you how you do that so uh, basically on all this it says download SD and with that what you can do is you can quickly just uh, download it straight to your computer and if it's not an HD it's a very small file so if you try to upload it to YouTube it's going to be uploaded instantaneously I'm talking less than a minute because that's how long it took for me and I don't even have that good of a computer it I doesn't have that much processing power and um, just a simple little Toshiba, it's not very powerful, but it, it uploaded the video in less than a minute, and it was in pretty good quality, and um, it was approximately uh, 30 sec no, 15 seconds, so um, it was a, is it, and uh, right here, if you can see, you can instantly share it with Facebook, uh, you can share it with Twitter, YouTube, all that uh, social media, you can share it instantly. And so now, um, I'm just going to show you what happens when you click download SD. Click 
click download SD and then this pops up if you're using Windows and then you can either open it or save it I'd say you should save it um, so that you have it so that uh, since this is an intro you're probably going to be putting it in the beginning of all your videos so that is probably the location you should probably save it to your, either your desktop or rename it and put and put it as your stock intro basically that is how you create an intro from flixpress.com very fast very simple very easy to use and it looks like very professional uh, intros and they're completely free now remember you can buy an intro but I don't think you need to because these already look amazing so um, you don't really need to do anything else besides uh, create a free intro and for example this is the robot x form intro create that and you're set put it in all your videos and uh, see what people think of your new intro so uh, this has been a video by Dinosaur on how to create free intros peace